Dear student, in this video we are going to see chapter number 2 that is parallel lines. In this chapter we are going to learn one important theorem that is alternate angles test. Let's start. Alternate angles test. Let's see the statement of this theorem. If a pair of alternate angles formed by a transversal of two lines is congruent then the two lines are parallel. So what is given in this statement? What we know in this statement? We know that the pair of alternate angles are congruent. Okay. And we have to prove that those two lines are parallel. So look at figure. You can see this in this figure. Line N is a transversal of line L and M. So in a given, we can write that line N is a transversal of line L and line M. And what else is given in this? It's given that pair of alternate angles are congruent. So look at this figure. Here I have taken angle A and angle B as one pair of alternate angles. And it's given that these two angles are congruent. So it means it is given that angle A congruent angle B that we will add in given part. Now we will go for the proof of what I have to prove. I have to prove that line L parallel line M. Let's see the proof of this. Now look at this figure here. I'm going to take one angle as C. You can see the figure. You can see that I have taken one of the angle as C. Now look at the proof of this theorem. Angle A plus angle C equals to 180 degree because they forms linear pair that is equation number one. You can see in this figure. Can you find angle A and C? You can see that angle A and C, right? They forms linear pair. Therefore, sum of these two angle is 180. Now here it is given that angle A congruent angle B, right? You can see in this figure angle A and angle B are congruent. Why? It's a given altered angles are congruent. That is equation number two. Now let's see equation one and two. Okay, what we will do, we will replace angle A of equation 1 by angle B because A and B are equal. So we will replace A by B of equation number 1. So you will get a new equation angle B plus angle C equals to 180 degree. This we got from equation 1 and 2. Look at this figure. Can you find angle B and C in this figure? Yes. What type of angles are they? they are interior angles and we know that if the interior angles are supplementary then the lines are parallel therefore line l parallel line m according to interior angles test 